So guys, today it's Friday morning and Faustino and I are going to jump back in the van and we're going to finish up on the plumbing. Uh, I don't know how far, how much we're going to get done today, but we're going to definitely get some stuff done. I mean, I hear it. Oh shit, hold on. Stop it, stop it, stop it. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to get this, uh, what is this thing called again? I must bar? forget it. Barred over this hose that we couldn't find at the store, and it's gonna be a problem. Yeah, see that? That ain't bite. Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's go to the store. Did you try these? I just had one in my hand, yeah. But I was trying to think of how how it works. Like, like a shower. So the mixer. Yeah, but I don't want it to be like a shower. I put shower. So are we trying to get just the one thing that's right. we're going to be able to right. do right. That's why we need, right. need something before the mixer. Well, we have everything but what we need for um, the outside shower. So what we're going to do now is I think we're probably going to leave Home Depot and take a quick run to Lowe's. Hopefully Lowe's has it. Uh, I'm sorry, that's like the security camera just making all kind of noise behind me. But anyway, hopefully Lowe's has it and uh, we can complete our plumbing today. I was starving, now I'm eating to my belly full. From up north, we get cold, you need a heavy coat. Scared to end up on a shirt before a centerfold. Devil on my back, target on me, deadly too. Play for keys, don't tweet. Don't play. It's not peace, don't speak. Don't play. 24, no sleep. Don't play. This is real, no tweet. My bros for life. life. Can't break this link. Family on my side. Baby, stay around me. Flex. I don't want no combo, I want checks. I don't want the second, I want this. I'm all in my swing, I'm a And we're getting ready to prime those, uh, the back cover wire, uh, wheel wells. We're getting ready to paint the wheel wells. And this will be the last time they'll look like this. And uh, we'll be able to put this wall up real soon. All right, so there you have it. We've primed both sides. Now we're going to let these dry. And we're going to hit it up with a... We got a gray that we're going to use. It's going to be basically this bluish gray. So this is the back side of the wall that you'll see from the garage side. We've already primed it. And what we're going to do now is basically paint it. So I just finished the first coat of our uh, gray. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it's pretty cool. It's like gray on gray, light gray, dark gray. That's how it looked before I put the molding on. And that's how it looks after. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, Yay! Good job, Dia. High five. <laughs> awesome. Hey, so what are you doing? What, what are doing? you looking for? I'm looking for the drill bit to uh, start to make a drill. To make a drill. To drill a screw into the piece of wood. Okay, guys. So, needless to say, that we are just a little bit rusty at this uh, vlogging thing because you guys know that uh, we had the camera down for about a few weeks anyway what we're doing today is we're going to start on our plumbing yes finally we're starting on our plumbing and i think that we have everything mapped out this is how it looks right now okay so this is what we'll be using well this is a few of the things that we'll be using this is not even everything i know you guys can see so you kind of get the picture so we'll put this somewhere about there and then we're going to mount the water heater to this and then mount this to the walls and then after that i think that we're going to mount our water filter that we received from the water filter store and uh faustino is going to tell you a little bit more about our water filter okay guys this is the essential whole rv water filter system and it's a powerful and compact system that's designed for van life and rvn it's also their best-selling system so if you want to give this uh, two-stage filter uh, a try uh, head on over to the rvwaterfilterstore.com so what i do every time we drill something or we screw something into the van is i check the side of the van just to make sure it didn't go through 
we added this uh, extra piece of uh, bracing so that way it's a uh, nice support. We're gonna basically put this bracket that came with the uh, the Bosch water here. We're gonna put it right about there. All right, guys. So now that we mounted our uh, our water heater. We're gonna go ahead and mount our uh, water filter from the uh, RV water filter store, and we're basically gonna mount this right about here. Okay. So that way we're able to feed water through here. And it'll come out through here and it'll fill our water tank on that side. So when you get your filter from the uh, RV water filter store, it's gonna come with this bracket and all the screws are supplied and also the instructions. So after we get the water uh, filter bracket on, we're gonna go ahead and put the top on to the uh, water filter. All right guys, now that the, uh, the mount is on, we're gonna go ahead and uh, Get ready to mount these uh, accumulator. Well, I'm gonna get ready to mount the accumulator and the water pump on. But uh, first, we're gonna clear this uh, out. Okay, guys. So this is me. I'm taking a break. Clearly, this is our coffee break. We'll just say it's our coffee. Uh. We'll just say it's our coffee break. I just need a little boost. Okay, so I think I'm ready. Well, as soon as I finish this, then I'm ready. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we are going to thread the accumulator. We're threading the water pump. The water pump, and we're also gonna thread the strainer. Everything that water is gonna touch is going to be threaded. With some uh, plumber's uh, pipe thread seal tape. Yeah, and I think we may have picked that up from Home Depot, so uh, you guys can definitely find it there. If not, I'll leave a link in the description below. And I think that what we'll do now is mount everything. Right. So right now tonight is uh, installing the uh, sea slow uh, water pump. Good morning, beautiful people. So guys, today it's Friday morning and Faustino and I are gonna jump back in the van and we're gonna finish up on the plumbing. So I think when we left off yesterday, we were mounting everything. So let me show you guys how it looks. So we mounted our filter, our water filter from the RV water filter store. And then right next to that, we have our water heater and then there's the accumulator and the water pump that's what we're doing i think Faustino is ready i see that he has his coffee there i'm ready are you ready yeah i'm about to uh rather get some work done this morning uh i don't know how far how much we're gonna get done today but we're gonna definitely get some stuff done okay <laughs> that's me okay folks so we're about to get started so uh this is like this right here so we're gonna go here and then I thought we we're gonna just put an elbow and go that way um, we can do that if this went down then yeah way better look and I think we should slide this tank over some more so that they both go down like just the tank when that goes down that's why all. can't it just go like this like this looks fine this is the exhaust right isn't this uh, the one that's gonna go outside of the van yeah okay so why can't it just Go like that. Uh, this looks absolutely. No, I can go like that. Okay, so he's going underneath. Is that going like that? Okay. So what we did today is basically we cut the nylon hoses to fit the uh, the areas that we're gonna need it to. So if you take a look, you'll see that we basically just got all the hoses. None, none of this is really in place right now. Uh, we're probably gonna come through tomorrow morning. Hopefully, uh, we can get the start, get the day started with no uh, interruptions. And we're gonna try to fix, finish this up. Um, but we did all our pre-cutting and uh, basically just pre-laid it out. So it should be easy tomorrow. Should be. So anyway, guys, before we wrap it up, what we're doing now is we are just going around placing all of um what are these tighteners these what are these are, called uh, so we're looking at the bag to get the correct name 
clamps. Clamps. Metal clamps. 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 Yeah. They're hose clamps. That's yeah, what they go. are. Ah. Hose so they're hose clamps. So yeah, so what we're doing is we're going around the van and we're basically putting hose clamps everywhere we know one needs to be. So what we're going to do now is uh, we're going to finish that and I think we'll pick the camera back up in the morning. What I just did, I just put this primer and cement on this PVC piping. That way we can get this union and we can get this uh, three quarter inch elbow into the top of the tank. So this one, this one here is for our fresh water out. Now the music's back on, I hope you can hear this. And now this is basically just a breather valve. I am trying to tighten up these clamp hoses that we're putting on all of our hoses. That's it. Right now, we're, we're uh, like tonight. Say we're attaching all the nylon hoses. Um, and hopefully, okay. we'll be able to get to the uh, PEX pipes uh, soon. Good morning, beautiful people. Well, guess what? Today is the uh, third or fourth. It's I don't know. It's either the third or the fourth day that we've been doing our plumbing. And guys, it's coming out amazing. I well, I think it's coming out amazing anyway. So let me show you. Uh, let me show you what we've done so far. So yeah. So this is what we have so far. So we got all the nylon hoses ran. Now remember, we did uh, two different sizes nylon hoses. We have three and a quarter and I think we have a half an inch so we got that done and then yesterday we started on our PEX pipe so this is what the PEX pipe looks like so far now we did the blue and we started on the red but it got kind of late so we stopped now these are what basically took so long like putting this configuration together so we had to put an elbow and then we had to put a coupling and then we had to put another elbow so trying to figure out where this goes and how it can fit properly in the van it took a long time it definitely took a long time so so guys i am ready to start working on the van Faustino just went inside and we're gonna try and get some work done before it starts raining let's see if you can see how the sky looks so guys like i said we're gonna get some work in before the rain comes down again and uh see you in the queue so was that one too long or too short it's a little bit just a little much too long see uh -huh. Now I'm gonna measure some PEX pipe so that we can get back to work. So we gotta run a 28 inch PEX pipe from the hot water out to the van. We are definitely about to clamp on these inch uh, clip rings onto our PEX pipe. Right, we're about to basically just start, uh, we're going to crimp up the final uh, portions of our hot water lines and we're also going to be attaching the uh, PEX pipes to the wall using these little nail brackets. Right there. Okay, so let me update you guys right quick. We've come so far. So we are almost finished. Like I said, we've come a long way. We've run the red pipe and the blue PEX pipe. And uh, yeah, so now what we're doing is we are turning here. Take a look. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn here, put two elbows on here. But before we do that, Fasino is gonna have to drill a hole right there so that uh, when we do put the elbows on they'll be able to go right through that whole turn and then that's going to be the water that's going to supply the sink area
Good morning, beautiful people. Well, today is the day. Faustino and I are going to go into the van and we're gonna test the water system. So we're gonna see if we have any leaks and uh, we're gonna keep our fingers crossed that we don't. Faustino, how are you feeling? I'm, uh, I'm feeling good. I think uh, I don't have any leaks this morning. Cool, sounds like a plan. All right, guys, let's go. So we're gonna put the water in through the filter and uh, we're going to fill up the water tank just a bit. We're not going to fill it up all the way for obvious reasons. Oh yeah, now it sounds like a Oh shit, hold on, stop it, stop it, stop it. So we're going to go ahead and try this again. Faustino, just put the rings on the water filter. Ah, uh, they're on our tight. Okay, you ready? Finally got the water pump working and uh, we realized that we have another leak. But uh, we just tightened up the clamp so hopefully we fixed that. So are you ready? We're about to start it again. No, not yet. Yeah, it's coming out. Now we're gonna go and give the water pump electricity from the back of the van. So people, we've connected the uh, water pump switch. Let's give the water pump some power. Alright guys, so today we are finishing uh, our outdoor plumbing. So we're going to run a hot and cold to a, this is a bib, which I was calling it a hose pipe. So we're putting this in here and this box is basically going to go like right about there. I'll show you in a few. And tonight I ordered this hose, I believe it was from Amazon. Uh, but we're getting this hose, it came with this and it came inside this bag and it's one of those flexible hoses. And we're basically going to mount that flexible hose right here next to our uh, RV water filter. So right here it's basically going to be like an outdoor shower. And then this box is this proximity somewhere maybe like right there. It's going to look like something like that. We are uh, we're plumbing today or we're starting to plumb. We're starting to plumb today. Plumb. We're starting to plumb. <laughs> I don't even know if that's the word. Ciao, I gotta get it together. Okay, okay, okay. Good morning, beautiful people. Well, guess what? Tomorrow's Dang's birthday, and hey, it's look, right there. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, you're good. Oh, I what this is. Cool. Oh, all right. oh, cool, thank you. Hey, so what are you doing? What are you doing? looking for? I'm looking for the drill bit to uh, start to make a drill. To make a drill. To drill a screw into the piece of wood. Uh oh, almost, almost. Let's try to do it again. Yeah, let's do it again. Oh, so close. So close. What should I mention, baby? Uh, they've uh, been along with us for the last three, four birthdays. Let me just. Uh, oh, no, you should do that. No, you should say it. So, if, if uh, yes. Poro. <laughs> I ain't brushing my teeth. I know I got coffee stains. So I'm looking for the drill bit that I misplaced, clearly, mm -hmm. because uh, I don't know where I put it. That's why I misplaced it. <laughs> so look. <laughs> you quit building this van every other day, dude. Oh my god. No, anyway. so you don't. Oh, no. so this is what I'm talking about. Now be real when the camera comes so on. I